Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel, She's French, and if you're new, welcome. If you don't know, my name is Jenna, I'm a French girl based in California, and I make videos about curating your life French girl style. Please, please, please subscribe. So today I'm a little bit more casual. I'm wearing one of Ryan's sweaters. I have been doing some updating, organizing, just kind of going through my closet and I figured now would be a really good time for me to show you my closet and um, show you any updates that I've made. I'm not going to try on everything because it's still pretty similar for the most part. It's the same, but I have added and switched out some pieces. So I wanted to show you what it was looking like right now so let's go ahead and go into the closet da, da, da. okay you guys i apologize for the lighting we're inside of the closet so there's not really any natural light but i think it's okay i think you can see so here is a little overview of what it's looking like it looks a lot fuller than it was before, but I've counted and there's about 22 pieces. I can't remember if I included the bags and shoes or not. I think I did. Um, but yeah, I wanted to show you what it looks like. You guys are pretty invested in my closet and how I style the little amount of clothes that I have. So I wanted to show you what it was looking like now. If you don't know, I had a baby. He is 10 months old now. So my body's been going through a lot of changes, a lot of transitioning. So I'm finally feeling like things fit how they used to. I'm not exactly the same size, so I did replace a couple things. You guys would have seen my new jeans that I got, things like that. Um, but for the most part, I feel very confident in the clothes now and I feel confident about the clothes that I own with them fitting and so on. I feel like for the last like almost year, I guess, things really weren't fitting right. I was kind of struggling to dress myself. I was trying to experiment, kind of re-figure out what I was about. But I feel like now it's kind of like back to normal, <laughs> I want to say. So let me show you everything. So first things first, we have the bags. I actually just made a video about my bag collection. I used to have four. I've pulled out two of the four. I'll link the video up above, but I've decided to part with two of the four bags. So these are the two that I have right now. The Prada one is pretty much my everyday bag. This one I kind of save more for like occasions or to dress up an outfit. This is the one I reach for always. And then over here we have a sweater and I normally keep a pair of sweatpants there as well. This is my very official kind of like around the house outfit. Um, I like to still feel kind of put together. Obviously right now I have Ryan's sweater on because that happens too. But for the most part, I'll be wearing this and the sweatpants. Then here I have some workout clothes. I have a pair of leggings and then a one piece that you would have seen me wear in a couple videos. That's from Nike. And then I have kind of a little like waist like not trainer but it kind of like compresses your core i've had that since postpartum and i like to wear it when i'm working out too and then we have pants over here so we have the two redone jeans you'll have seen those in a new video as well um i would suggest kind of going through my channel i've been posting a lot of fashion content and then I have a pair of Abercrombie jeans and this is a pair of shorts that I've had since before. I'm not too sure that these guys are going to fit. I'm finding that my size is about one size bigger than I was before having Zen, my son. But I don't know, I kind of, summer's not here just yet. I want to see if maybe they'll work again. If not, I will have to replace them because it would be good for me to have a pair of shorts in California. But we'll see. So I'm kind of holding on to these. I'll try them again soon see what happens <laughs> up here it's still the same this is my socks this is my underwear this is like um, miscellaneous bits and then this is my bikini and then down here it looks pretty similar for the most part it's all the same i need to go in and like steam oh my gosh i nearly fell backwards <laughs> I need to go in and kind of steam things, lint roll, things like that. I want to do like a nice like closet maintenance, I guess, moment. <laughs> but for now, this is what it's like. I've been meaning to do that. Right now, my main priority was just to go through, declutter, or like curate. There's not so much decluttering that happens with my closet with how small it is. But I do still pick out little pieces and switch them out. 
So I guess let me show you some pieces that are newer in my closet. The first one is this little bandeau top by Jacques Mousse. And then let's see, whoops. I finally found a t-shirt. Oops, everything's falling. This one is from Maritzia. I've actually owned this t-shirt before. I just needed a refresher. You might have seen in one of my videos, I was trying to find like the perfect t-shirt, but in the end, I already had it. I just needed to repurchase it. So this is Aritzia, amazing t-shirt. I got it in a double XS, just so that it would be like really cropped and like tiny and I love the fit. This is a newer piece too. This is from RUMI. I got it from their sample. Um, I guess sample sale on Depop. Super cute little cardigan. And actually that was about it for the newer pieces. Um, like I said, it stays pretty constant. Next up are my shoes. I still own four pairs of shoes. And those are the Peloton shoes. So just for working out, not going anywhere shoes. They have um, cleats that you clip into the bike. So of course we have the new Balenciagas. I'm so in love with them. I feel so blessed to have them. It's it's really cool. I've been wanting these for a long time. And this is none of this is to brag. This is just to show that you can be put together with a tiny closet. This is not a bragging channel. I'm not that kind of person. If anything, I like things to be very subtle. Next, we have the little white Prada heels. We have the Miu Miu loafers and then we have the black low Ugg boots. So I feel like with these, I have, these are obviously my casual shoes. This is what I'll reach for every day. These are for when I want to dress up. This is for if I want to have like kind of a different vibe. And these are just really nice for the winter, just to throw on when I'm running errands. Really cool, really warm, love them. And that's it, you guys. The closet is still very similar. But I figured I would show you some new in bits and what it's looking like currently. So that was everything. Still very similar, but I did want to show you what it's looking like, what I'm kind of picking from in a way, just so that I guess the lifestyle makes sense. Still super minimal. That's a constant in my life that doesn't change. But like I said, I do have variety switch pieces in and out, especially right now. I feel like I was switching pieces more just because I was kind of having to experiment things weren't quite working but now I feel really comfortable in what I have and I feel like it all makes sense again I know I've been saying that for a little while but if you had a baby you, you know what it's like and if you're planning to this is kind of something that happens I think a lot of people will go through this where your body takes a little bit of time to get back to what you're used to so in the meantime sometimes it's a little bit difficult but yeah, let me switch to the better lighting for the outro. All right, so I'm back out here because the light is a little bit better out here. It's a little bit later in the day, but I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed the little updated closet tour. Please, please, please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye, guys. Yeah.